to go back to the balloon, um, does the Pentagon know with certainty now that the balloon actually came from China? Uh, I, it was launched from China, and if so, where? And then the DOD has said that there have been at least three other balloon incidents during the previous administration and one other incident during this administration. Can you tell us a little bit about how you were able to discern that these balloons were the same and they were also Chinese spy balloons? Sure. Um, so uh, let me address your uh, second questions. Well, your second question first. Uh, so again, um, I'm not able to go into the intelligence. Uh, as you highlight, we are aware that there have been four previous balloons uh, that have gone over uh, U.S. territory. Um, this is what we assess as part of a larger Chinese uh, surveillance balloon program. Um, you've heard us talk in the past about the fact uh, that this is a program that's been uh, operated for several years. Um, what we do know is that uh, in some cases, whereas some of these balloons previously had not been identified, subsequent analysis, subsequent intelligence analysis did enable us to indicate uh, that these were Chinese balloons. In terms of where they're coming from, I can't go into the specific location other than to say China. Uh, and I, the last thing I'll say is that uh, this last week provided the United States with a unique opportunity uh, to learn a lot more about the Chinese surveillance balloon program, all information that will help us to continue to strengthen our ability to track these kinds of objects. 